we're going to demonstrate how to wire any of the three solenoid gate locks that we have on gatecrafters.com, whether it's the estate swing gate lock, the gatecrafters gate lock, or the GTO gate lock, to the LiftMaster LA400 circuit board. We're going to use the lock control board that's provided with the gate lock. Each one of those three comes with a lock control board that looks like this. I'm going to scoot everything over so we can trace each wire to what connection it's made. Starting from the left hand side of the lock control board, terminal 1 is going to be connected to the COM of the lock output on the LA400 board. If you can't read the COM or the NO markings, this comes off and you can see it more clearly underneath. The center one is COM. The second wire will go to the negative of the battery that is connected to the negative of the control board. I'm going to flip these batteries up so you can see what I'm talking about. On the LA400 you have two batteries that are wired in series. When wired in series you're going to have two terminals that are connected together. A negative on one of the batteries and a positive on the other battery. The fifth terminal goes to two locations. It goes to the NO terminal on the lock output of the control board. That's the bottom terminal. I connected a second wire into that terminal that goes to the positive lead of the battery that is connected to the positive lead of the control board connection. As you can see, I used a piggyback connector. And here are my two wires, one of which goes to terminal number five and one of which goes to the circuit board. Again, this has two wires going into it, one to the circuit board one to the battery.